Hi friends, thank you so much for joining us today. We are going to be making some excellent crafts. And I am Miss Erica and I work at the Lafayette Arts and Crafts Center. So today we are going to be making paper bag puppets. And I have an example of this puppet. And this is actually my dog Banjo. And then I have a kitty puppet and a frog puppet. And what's so fun about the frog puppet is that it has legs and a twisty tongue and he ribbits and ribbits and jumps all over town. But the craft that we're going to do today for our puppet is we are going to finish making this very silly monster. So I've already started and I have my paper bag and he's gonna have stripes on his tummy and he's going to have sharp teeth in his mouth and pointy horned ears. So I have my puppet, and when I start with my puppet, I need to make sure that the flap is in the front. If the flap's in the back, then my puppet's not going to have a mouth. So I'm going to take my glue, and I'm going to start to glue my pieces to the puppet. And it's important when you do this that you just use a tiny bit of glue. You don't need a lot of glue. Just a little bit of glue goes a very long way. So there's the inside of his mouth. Now my monster has a red mouth, so I have some red pieces cut out. Stick that in there. Now I need to put his sharp teeth because all monsters in my world have sharp teeth. Let's see. Oh, yeah. So there's the inside of his mouth. And now we're going to put his nose on because a monster has to smell. And his silly eyes, I have those all cut out. And when you do your craft at home, you can use construction paper to glue onto your paper bag. And if you don't have construction paper, that's okay because you can always just draw silly faces on your paper bag to make your very own silly monster. So now we have his face, and let's get his horns on there so that he can hear us. Because monsters love to hear what's going on. Stick those on the back so he has one horn, two horns. Now we're going to look at him. How does he look? He looks pretty silly, I think. That's what I'm going to go for. And now I'm going to try him out. Oh, yeah, look at him. He's a pretty mean, silly looking monster. Now I'm going to sit him down, give him a little press, make sure all his glue is stuck down. And he's all finished. So what's great about this monster is that you can make this monster at home. But if you also want to take classes, the Lafayette Arts and Crafts Center offers classes for kids just like you. And we have classes right now that are starting online. You can watch and participate in classes virtually. Have a good day.